At CBF, we know that for you to change your body, you need to change your mind. Exercise and eating healthy is only part of the plan. We care about our members as we care about our family because our members become our family. It is not about competition, but support. It is not about being the strongest or the fastest, but about you defeating your negative self. It is about working together and making the task challenging and have fun. By the end, what matters is not how hard the session was, but that you take control of your mind so you can take control of your body. My name is Sandro Torres, and I'm happy you are part of our family. Welcome to Custom Body Fitness. Welcome everybody here with another Talk With You Health Coach, Sandro Torres. And today we're gonna talk about how you're gonna stay in shape during these holidays. Even though there is not a pill to stay in shape and stay healthy, there is an easy way for you to stay in shape. And that's what I'm gonna be talking about today. I'm gonna give you the tips that I use and I teach our members to, to uh, they use to stay in shape during the holidays. So we're gonna begin with the first one. The first one is stay active. It's only three hours during the week. So first of all, Christmas is not the whole week. It's only one day. But yeah, you need to prepare for Christmas and so on. People are gonna come and visit you. You are gonna go visit people and so on. That, that's true. But out of those two days, you only need probably an hour, one hour. During the whole week, you're probably going to need three hours to stay in shape. So think about it. You can put aside three hours of your whole week to continue being active and to continue being in shape. So that's my first tip. Keep that in mind. You don't have to spend all day, many hours, only three hours during that holiday week and the next holiday week as well. So next thing is eat healthy. It's very simple. So it's okay for you to cook and cook a lot of food. Just choose your foods smart. So what I mean with that is don't buy processed food. Buy whole foods. Buy organic food. Cook it at home. And if you go and visit people, uh, you probably don't have the... Um, the choice for you to, to, to decide what, how they're gonna cook because they're cooking, but maybe mention it. Maybe they will agree with you. Maybe you buy the ingredients and so on. Be smart when you cook. That's the first thing. Second, don't limit yourself when eating. Yeah, if there is a lot of food in the, in the table, eat everything in the table, but make a, a reasonable, portion on your plate. So grab pieces of all the food that you want to taste and make a reasonable portion on your plate so you get to taste all the food. You don't have to limit yourself by not eating some things, but make sure once again they're cooked uh, with organic and whole food. Next thing, don't buy any sugary drinks, don't buy any sodas, any, any energy drinks and energy drinks and so on. There is other substitutes that you can use to 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 drink on the, on those holidays there is sparkling water there is kombucha there is uh, fresh fruit uh, waters made make a home there is other things that you can do and lastly and this is very important think about how long you've been working on of, on being in shape and being healthy more than anything don't hurt your body by drinking a lot I personally think that you should not be drinking because you're hurting your body when you're doing that because um, it's, it's a chemical and your body is trying to get rid of, the, of that alcohol once you uh, the, um, drink that alcohol. Of course, that requires a different is, is speech, but I'm only going to tell you that it's nothing positive about drinking. However, if you don't have the strength to overcome that desire of drinking, limit your drinking. Drink less. Remember, next day you're gonna feel better. The next thing is revise your goals. 
yeah, go back and check your goals. Have you accomplished your goals? Have you lost the way you say you're going to lose? Have you follow the new habits that you're going to say you're going to follow? Have you complete all the promises that you made yourself back in the beginning of, of this year? If you've done that, great. If you haven't, so it's good for you to stay in track for these last two weeks of the year. That checking your goals will reinforce your decisions of making the right decisions. So it's very simple. Just follow those steps. First of all, stay active in, in the holidays. Only three hours a week. That's all you need. In Custom Body Fitness, we only open three days on the holidays because that's all you need. Three hours. Second thing, eat healthy. Don't drink any sugar or drinks. Don't buy processed food. Don't cook processed food. Cook whole foods, yeah, organic food. Uh, limit your alcohol or don't drink at all. And last thing, revise your, your goals. Those are the things that you need to keep in mind in this holiday season for you to stay in shape and healthy. Now, Merry Christmas. Enjoy your Christmas. Of course, enjoy your family. That's the reason why Christmas is here. We are here to celebrate Christmas. Uh, we are here to celebrate the birthday of Jesus, of God. I really wish that you get a lot of hugs, a lot of love, and a lot of support, and you spend quality time with your loved ones, because that's more valuable to material things that don't matter. Remember, once again, by the end, we're celebrating Jesus' birthday, and in these holidays, we, it should be to forgive, to love, to give, to care, to get closer to our loved one. I really wish that to you. Merry Christmas. And we're going to be tuning in in the next episode. Thank you so much for continuing following us. And share this talk to people who need to listen to this um, message. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. If you enjoyed the content offered here, then I know you will enjoy these books. These are great tools to lead you to successful weight loss, better health, and greater happiness.